getting results. 545 on your Thursday. You know what that means? It's time for Ask Trooper Steve. <laughs> where we answer the questions you send in. And Steve, today we're talking about tail lights. So it sounds super easy, but you know we always dive into something specific. So this is what we're talking about. Why do so many trailers being pulled by vehicles have lights on them that do not work? And whoever submitted this question, I ask myself this all <laughs> I the see time. It too. So this is kind of what we're talking about a little bit here. So we have all these extra trailers that can get attached to vehicles. And it's probably every single day you can drive out there and there'll be a tail light missing. Mm -hmm or the vehicle's lights will be working and the trailer lights are not. So Florida law does require those trail, uh, tail, uh, see you mix up the words there and you can't talk. <laughs> those trailer lights to be operating the exact same way on your vehicle. So if your turning signals are activated, these need to work. It is probably the most neglected area of a vehicle and it's mm -hmm. not done very intentionally. So you just always need to make sure that those wires are properly fastened to each other Super cheap to fix, too, at any automotive store. You can walk in there. These prices, these devices are very cheap to make sure that they're working properly. And electrical tape goes a long way. <laughs> so I am no handyman by any means, but I've pulled a few trailers here. And just taking that extra time to wrap your devices to make sure it works, get a partner out there, make sure your taillights are working. It can be very dangerous if they're not. And having your hazard lights flashing because the trailer lights are not is not an exemption to the law. Mm -hmm. So make sure your stuff's good. All right. Thank you, Trooper Steve. It's all about the safety for you and those out on the roadways. If you have any questions for Trooper Steve, you can let him know on our website. Just head to clickorlando.com slash Steve.